Once saved, always saved. John 3.36 ends all our worries. He that has the Son has everlasting life. You don't have to wait till you die to find out if you're saved. Once you've received Jesus Christ and you have him in your heart and you love him and you know him and you believe on him as your saviour, there are no ands, ifs or buts about it. You are a saved child of God. You have eternal life right now. And you are the Lord's forever. You already have salvation. You don't need to worry about whether or not you're going to lose it. Or how you are going to manage to stay saved. Because eternal salvation by grace means once saved, always saved. Besides, you can't keep yourself saved any more than you could save yourself in the first place. Only Jesus can do it. So even though you're not perfect and you're bound to make mistakes, you don't need to beat yourself up about it. God is going to save you anyway. Once you've received Jesus, you are completely purified and redeemed in the eyes of God by the sacrifice of Christ on Calvary. That's the amazing love of Jesus Christ and the mercy of God. You're saved right now because God has promised it and God's word is true. God's word proves that salvation is forever. God's word proves that he's already given it to you and he's not going to take it back. God's word proves that it's yours. Praise the Lord. Of course, this raises many questions. What if I willingly sin? Can I hand the gift of salvation back to Jesus? And what about Hebrews 10.26? Once you're a child of God, you are given a certain liberty, but if you willingly step too far out of line, like any loving father, your heavenly father is going to chastise you accordingly, but you're not going to lose your salvation. You can't give your gift of salvation back to God because Jesus paid a ransom for you. So your gift is no longer a bargaining point that you have any say in. You belong to Jesus. And somehow or another, he is going to perfect that which he has begun in you. Furthermore, once you belong to Jesus, there remains no sacrifice that can wash away your sins. You've been totally cleansed and you only need your daily sins forgiven. And only Jesus can do that. For I am persuaded that neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Once saved, always saved. John 3.36 ends all our worries. This has been presented by the Jesus Explains channel on YouTube and Rumble and endtimesofficial.com. That's endtimesofficial.com.
the end times teaching ministry where Bible prophecy is made easy to understand.